Hello everyone, LBT Electric Down 75 once again, and welcome back to another video. And finally, finally, yeah, I finally made it to Memorial City Mall after all these years since 2021. And yeah, we're finally at the Jurassic World section. And holy cow, it is that full of Jurassic World Dinosaur figures. Yeah, I said it. Holy barnacles. And the Giganotosaurus. Eh. Ooh. Huh. That figure. Eh. Look at it. Wonder if this can do. Holy cow. Huh, the Giganotosaurus. With the wobbly body. Eh, not, eh, not a fan of the Giganotosaurus nearly as much as I am with the uh, Carcharodontosaurus, which I got from 2021, which is kind of cool, but this one. Holy cow. Will I get this figure for my collection? No, but for what it is, it looks nice, but like I say in my review, I'm never gonna get the Giganotosaurus figure. Never, 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 never. No, no, no. And the Scorpius from Camp Cretaceous. Is, the, the guy is still there after a year and a half. <coughs> Come on, buddy. Holy cow. You're telling me that this figure could open its mouth with this part. Yeah. Holy cow. This looks, this, look, this looks terrifying. And the same thing cannot be said about the Indominus Rex. Eh, I can have a soft spot for it, but really. Yeah, I might get it some other time, and... Oh, aside from that, there's the Therizinosaurus. Huh. This is one of Gus's favorite dinos in the movie, and it looks cool, and... Man, I should have done this vlogging since July, or June. What, the barnacles? Wow. This guy looks... This guy looks terrifying. This guy looks good. Okay. Guess if you're watching this, this video is for you, and... Uh, doesn't roll his body? Barnacles. What a knockoff. I might check it out some of the time when I go to other stores. The same cannot be said about the Thrasher Rex. Or, in this case, Thrash and Devour Tyrannosaurus Rex. <laughs> Pretty loud and pretty neat and oh not to mention I forgot to tell you that this Memorial City is quiet and somewhat silent in my opinion but and then as for the the Owen escape pack with the two Atrociraptors and the Carnotaurs not a fan of the the figures especially with the Carno where they have to make it juvenile like but I respect those who had the Carnotaur figures especially my friends I respect them nearly as much but the Atrociraptors I think I have a soft spot for. But I will be viewing this Mosasaurus that came from Jurassic World Dominion. Holy cow. This Mosasaurus is one of the big ones in Jurassic World, but I think I might get it for my collection. I think I might do so. But this figure's heavy. I think I might think I might do something right right now and get it someday but for now luckily for me I got this amber collection triceratops yeah this was the only figure that I've been waiting for for past decades now 
because it's a Triceratops. At least that's something to be new and something to be proud of. And obviously, still better than the, the, the Triceratops that we have for Dominion, especially this one where it does its Do I remember seeing this in Walmart? Yeah. Cool. Because I think I did. Oh, there's a sign of Ceratops right behind them. Right behind them. Cool. Look at the sign of Ceratops. Look at the guy. Look at him. Uh, well, I get this guy for my collection. Since I never had a sign of Ceratops. Yes. I, I think I must get him. Along with this guy. But I think I might pick a choice. I think LBT. But maybe I'll get them both. Just for, the, just for something like this. Forget this uh, Hammond Collection Tyrannosaurus Rex, because all, because at least he he has a member fan base. At least I'm getting these two, which that's that's the bright side. So yeah, since the Hammond Collection Dilophosaurus isn't here, why not bother get this guy? Yeah, since I never had a Sinoceratops before, but holy cow, is that a Carnotaurus that came right out from Primal Carnage? In a toy line like this, shit you not. This looks like the Carnotaurus from Primal Carnage, but except for the fact that it has two fingers on each hand, and that human figure looks like from a Jurassic World knockoff. And why do they always put these dinosaur figures with these human characters? Like why? 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 Like why? 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 I just don't get it. Yeah, putting dinosaurs with human characters like this. Please stop, stop, stop. Stop. He wants you to stop. You see what I mean? They always do this all the time. Except for this one. Which, at least he's acceptable, but... I mean, looks like a recycled uh, Jurassic Park 3 Tyrannosaurus Rex. Chomping mouth and all those other stuff. Oh, look at this. This is just... I have nothing else to say, but... Yeah, look at this. Oh, they have this big battle set with the Tyrannosaurus, the Therizinosaurus, and the Unionotosaurus. Unbelievable. I remember seeing this in a commercial from Jurassic World. Look how huge this thing is. Unbelievable. Now they're releasing big battle sets. But how they're going to make the fences this big? How they're going to do it? I don't know. I have no idea. But hey, set may not be great, but at least it's passable to fans compared to this. Great. Now there's a. I wonder if I could try both buttons like that. Huh. Holy cow. Oh, the Disney core. Finally. Oh, everything has been changed and silently. Oh, and Anna's boots are still there. I can understand why and even big size. I think I might take one view of them one more time. One more time. Right. Wait. Give me a second then. Then. There. Huh. Pretty sure a friend of mine would like these. But hey. These are good in them. Get 
get. And as for Elsa's boots, they look kind of detailed. I may not like the movie Frozen 2, but oh man, their costumes look kind of nice. And I might zip this one up. I wonder if the other one is. Hmm. Looks good in the inside. And on the other side, ew, probably nice. Holy cow. That's all there ever is? Wow. Jurassic World Dominion Extended Edition. I might get this one, even though I'm not a big fan of the Jurassic World uh, franchise. There's Jurassic Park 1 to 6. Are you serious? Man, that's a big, heavy collection case. This is very heavy. There is no way I'm collecting a franchise this, this big and large. Oh, and there's Camp Cretaceous on DVD. Huh, that's... Seriously? Wow. I've already had this on my Netflix area. And I also have this. Why, why do I bother getting a Hotter Straight Dragon trilogy if I have the Blu-ray version? How, how much if I have to get all this in, in, a, in a collection case like this? Wow. Hmm. DVDs and all something that I didn't care for, but... Alright then, I just got back from... Target in Memorial City and for the vlogging experience it wasn't that great and it wasn't as good as the one from last year which last year was better but as for now at least I got my birthday gifts along with me two which I owned and I got the extended edition to Jurassic School Dominion which is the 4k version first time getting that I hope you Jurassic School Dominion fans are happy because May not be a fan of it, but I think I might check out the the extended edition to see if it's better than the actual film. But we'll get to that later. But as for now, at least I got the Hammond Collection Triceratops, which. But on top of that, at least I got the Hammond Collection Triceratops, and looks kind of detail and looks nice from the first Jurassic Park movie, which it looks nice. Since I got the DVD of Jurassic Park. This is what I got. And as for Sinoceratops, I'm happy to get a Sinoceratops. I'm happy. Honestly, I never had a Sinoceratops before, but first time having it. Well, at least I'm good with it, but yeah, aside from that, the, the blogging wasn't that great, but last year's own is better. So maybe next time if I want to go to Target, it's not the Memorial City one, but it's something very, very different. A very different Target, which will make my mother happy and all those other stuff. And if you want to go to Free Spirits channel, I'll put a link down below. Also, here's a quick shout out to Free Spirit is, by the way. If you're watching this, this video is for you. But anyways, LBT here. See you guys next time. And I think I might do a live stream during this birthday live stream, but no time for live streams right now. So... Welcome home.